Well, good morning, YouTube. I hope you guys are having a great week. Excited for Thanksgiving coming up. I'm just uh, nursing down a little liquid courage here. <sighs> um, if you have company in town, I hope it's uh, not keeping you stressed. I think the holidays can be particularly stressful sometimes in terms of gatherings around food. If you have a particular dietary restriction or um, uh, you know an allergy or you don't eat meat. But today I wanted to share with you guys a recipe that is inspired from the Connoisseur Vegan. If you haven't checked out the Connoisseur Vegan, even if you're not a vegan, I'm going to link the information below where to get this recipe. So here's what I'm going to be making today guys. It is savory chickpea muffin cups with a smoky tomato sauce and I've just decorated it with a little baby sage leaf because I think it looks cute. But aren't these adorable and like they're easy to bring um, and the kind of thing that you can make ahead of time. Non-vegans will enjoy this recipe. Now the way I'm making them today is not actually vegan. I'm, I'm cheating and using a, a non-vegan ingredient. The actual ingredient is, is easy to, to come by. For the first half of this recipe, I'm gonna be using organic flaxseed meal, coconut oil, liquid smoke, ground pepper, tomato paste, two 14 ounce cans of garbanzo beans drained. I'm using one box of seasoned cornbread stuffing mix. However, to make this vegan, you could also use panko crumbs. I'll also be using two carrots, two celery ribs, a quarter of a white onion, and two cloves of garlic. You'll also need um, a non-dairy milk of your choice, a food processor, or in my case, I'm gonna be using my, my trusty Ninja here. And before starting, A, make sure your stove is empty. <laughs> I frequently preheat my oven with crap in there because um, I use it as storage sometimes. So make sure that bad boy's empty and preheat it to 375 degrees. A six cup muffin tin pre-sprayed with a little bit of non-stick cooking spray. Got out two tablespoons of the coconut oil and I gave it a quick little nuke for 30 seconds in my microwave. I'm just gonna get to dicing. So here you can see I've mixed together the two cans of garbanzo beans drained, package of the cornbread stuffing mix, my two diced carrots, my two diced celery ribs, my two diced garlic cloves, and my chopped up onion. Mixed them together with a spoon, and now I'm going to add a few other things. And mm, roughly about two tablespoons of uh, tomato paste, two tablespoons of organic flaxseed meal, melted coconut oil, flicks of the uh, liquid smoke, six cranks on the fresh ground black. So there's all the ground up vegetarian meat. It's ready to be shaped into individual loaves for my muffin tin. This is now gonna go into the oven at 375 degrees for 30 minutes. About two servings left over here. Uh, so technically I probably could have made eight of those. And you can eat this raw on, on a crudite or on crackers just as is. You can totally stop at this point. While the loaves are baking, you can go ahead and whip up this little glaze. What was left of this 3.3 ounce can of uh, tomato paste. Two tablespoons of maple syrup, two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar, another risk flick of the liquid smoke, two uh, turns on this bad boy, an eighth of a teaspoon of ground ginger, and an eighth of a teaspoon of uh, paprika. After they've baked for 30 minutes, you're just gonna take them out and spoon over a little bit of the glaze onto each one. And so now this is gonna go back in the oven for about 20 minutes. All right guys, and there you have it. They're completely cooled and you can see they stand up nicely on their own and uh, they look pretty good. Um, so it's afternoon time and I'm actually having one of the uh, one of these bad boys for lunch. I just wanted you to see the interior. You can see it, it looks like a nice little meatloaf almost. Uh, I'm pretty happy with how these came out and they taste delicious. I'm having it with a pumpkin pie uh, smoothie that I made. So that's gonna wrap up the video today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it's uh, fun for you to make and uh, maybe can be helpful in terms of throwing together a last minute uh, Friendsgiving uh, food to bring uh, or a potluck or just your, just your run of the mill meal prep uh, week for meals through the week for yourself. So um, comment below. Uh, I hope you all enjoyed the video uh, and share it with your friends, guys. Give it a thumbs up and as always, don't forget, sunscreen and subscribe. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Happy Thanksgiving week.